Hey guys, Dr. Christy Ennis from drchristyennis.com. Today I want to go over a very simple total body stretching routine that you can do at work or at home. Now, I see a lot of people during the day that have hip problems, neck problems, well really kind of total body problems. Those are some of the biggest areas and they often tell me, Christy, I just don't have enough time during the day to get up and go stretch. There's just not, my work is too busy, I have to be at my desk. So with all of you people in mind, and this can actually be myself included too sometimes, I'm gonna go through a full body stretch that you can do while seated at your desk. So that means there aren't any more excuses because this doesn't take very long to do. You can break it up however you want to, depending on what feels tighter during the day. I'm gonna start from up in the neck and then work down. That tends to be the easiest way to ease into that flow. So first one you're gonna do is just little head tilt side to side. So I'm doing a little bit of motion here and then forward and back. Notice I'm not doing circles because I don't want to grind into those joints, but this is a great way to ease into the day. And then you can even do some little, you guys have seen this one a thousand times if you watch my videos at all, but one of my favorites is that little chin tuck. Really kind of open up this whole area, working on that posture a little too. And then we're gonna move on to stretching this side of the neck. So you'll take arm behind the back, opposite hand on top of that head. It's just resting gently. And then you're gonna tilt that head over to the other side. You can pull very gently on the head, but don't yank because that is counterproductive to what we're trying to do. Gentle, nice, comfortable stretching. And then from there, we're gonna get the tricep as well as another neck muscle. So if I bring that arm all the way up behind, try not to pull on the elbow, but behind the arm, and then add that little head tilt over, you'll get the tricep and another neck muscle. And then coming out of that, if we wanna open up that chest a little bit, scooching forward on that chair just a little bit if you have a backrest clasping those hands together behind you. Sometimes just this is enough of a stretch. If not, gently squeeze those shoulder blades and then uh, raise those arms up. If you need to, you can even add a little bit of a forward bend. You'll get a little bit more into the lower back there. Good. From there, to get kind of the back of the shoulders and more of the shoulder, this is a yoga pose that I'm borrowing. So if you cross one arm under the other, wrap them around, and lift. Notice I, I have a little bit of limited flexibility here. We all have our issues that we need to be working on. And then obviously you would do both sides. All right, so neck, shoulders, tricep, and then moving on down. A great one for the hip is if you cross one ankle over and your knee may be up here, that's okay, you start there. If you can let it open a little more, even better. If that feels like a stretch, you stay there. And if you want more stretch, notice I'm not just slumping forward, right? I'm bringing my chest forward and then letting my head rest down. This is a great way to open the hip and everyone can do this while they are in their chair at work, okay? Both sides, again, to get that hip flexor, the front of that hip, which gets so darn tight when we sit so much, you do need to have a chair that doesn't have an armrest to it. And what you'll do is you'll kind of scoot your butt off the side Drop that one leg back and you're stretching all out through here. This is it. You can even do this while having a meeting. So I could be talking to someone and they never know if they're not looking down here. Again, both sides. And then one last one to get that hamstring and the calf. If you go ahead and put one leg straight out, sometimes you'll feel a stretch just doing that. If not, same idea, bring that chest forward. I'll show you from the side. So leg out chest forward until you feel stretch. You may feel it more up here or you may feel it more down here and that's okay one way or the other. You can even play around with the position of the leg and where you feel it the most. So to start out, try to get both sides if you can. 20 to 30 seconds and you can do this routine multiple times a day. Again, gentle, nice, easy, and you should feel really good by the end of your workday if you fit these in through the day. And again, break it up however you need to because you may not have all that time in one lump sum and that's totally okay. 
So thank you so much for tuning in today. Check out my website at drchristiennis.com where you can sign up for my newsletter. And thank you so much again for tuning in. Stay tuned for more.